Good day viewers, welcome to Beef Footage channel. Today we are making crossbar loafers. Stay tuned. Okay, so as we all know the first step of shoe making, whereby we place a pattern on our leather, on our material, so as to bring out the design and the size uh, the design of the, the shoe we are making. And if if you are just watching for the first time, you can just go back to, to our last video and our previous video and see how it is done. We have our leather lining ready on ground, so we join it together with the with the shoe we are making with the material, and we sew it together so that we'll be able to to tape it. So after sewing together, we apply gum on it and we, we tape it together. We, we fold it together. So after the taping is done, we lining it. We, know, we all know the next step whereby we lining it. We place our leather on our lining and we mark it out. We put the we put gum on the uh, necessary places and 
uh, and we apply gum on him, we come in together and we take it back for, for sewing. After sewing our material alongside with our lining, the, the next step is sizing, whereby we size our last with our shoe so as to know the exact size we are making so as not to make an excess size and you know to make a perfect size. Then we join we join the back together.
yeah after joining our back we saw it as usual we trim it out the norms and you know we we, we took it for filing we filed the necessary part and as we all know our lining is already available our, our insurer that it's already on ground it's ready for for use so after 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 that we we, we knock our insurer alongside with the last and we fight the necessary parts you can see where we we fight here uh then we apply gum on both the insulin and the the material so then here is the lasting process whereby we couple our shoe alongside with our last and to to bring out the size and the shape to, to mold a shoe yeah this is what we call molding of shoe so we last then after lasting we all know the the next step which is the front stay aspect whereby we knock our front stay you know to bring out the the, the front shape and to to, to make uh, to, to to give a standing shoe to make it stand you know to to, to stand the the shoe whereby the, the, the you won't you won't have to carry your shoe and the sole will be shaking will be dancing up and down so that that uh, front stay helps in 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 molding and it helps in the in in the building of of a shoe. Yeah, let me just put it out in in, in the building of a shoe. So we will last and we will, after lasting we put a front stay. We added the front stay, we knock it and see and you know, do the normal thing and we we couple it. Then on to the next one, which is the uh the strap we are, we are adding to it which is called the the crossbar like the, the design implies crossbar loafers Like I said, we already know the design we are making, which is the crossbar loafers. And while lasting, we have to take our elastic, we cut it out, we cut it into four pieces and into yet yeah, into four pieces. And you know, we added gum to the tip of it to, to, to the last end, to the to the end, and to uh, both sides. We added gum to both sides and just the tip, and we we. You know we leave it for, for, for some time normal thing you leave your gum for you can't just gum immediately after after adding gum you can't just gum your material immediately after adding gum if you want a firm job but 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 you see we we coupled our shoe shoe here while lasting well after adding gum when uh we, we did our what's it called our film stick yeah, we, we, we coupled we, we couple it immediately. Yeah, that's that about that. That's just how that one works. That's how it works. You might decide to leave it for two minutes, for sorry, for 30 seconds for fresh air or, or so, for breeze to blow on it. But it depends on what you want and it depends on what you are making. Yeah, it depends on how professional you are. So that's it.
Thank you.
okay there is this there is one thing about this crossbar it's also it's also applies to half shoe making you can go you can go and check our previous video on half shoe more videos are, are still coming anyways one thing about it is once you, you last a shoe or even if you are making slide once the last one you, you uh, uh, sorry an half shoe once the last one you take the second last which you have not done anything on it you put it together and you mark you mark it out so that you make mistake one leg will not be longer or shorter than one so the same thing applies to this crossbar we did the uh the, the sizing together we put it together and we, we had to mark it out so that one strap or one elastic it won't be longer it will be it won't be ahead of the second one so that's that about that that's how it works We all know the last step whereby we use our, our toe to mark out the, the uh, necessary area we are going to apply our gun. And we, we find the toe, we also find the, the, the shoe. This is a rubber toe anyway. And, and again, one thing about this material is that this velvet is it's not something you can put on fire. We don't fit it like unlike the previous one we've done on our on our channel we didn't need this one if, if we look at it we take a close look at it we, we, we didn't eat it we only eat it so because there are no you don't eat all materials there are some materials you eat and there are some we just have to leave and you, you, you only eat the so then after eating the so we join it together and our shoe is done so after joining, after eating up, putting the show together, our shoe is done, we did our clean up, our finishing, clean up, polish, spray, and yeah, we are good. And yeah, we have our loafers, our, our crunch bar loafers is ready for use. 
so you can always uh, and okay more content are still coming on how to lock your your shoe the outfits you can wear on you know on your shoes and you know to to give to bring a corporate a, a corporate wear and a, you know something reasonable other than wearing something that is no invoke and everything so more content has to come in on that thank you very much for watching today's episode do well to to like our video like share comment and subscribe to our youtube channel for more positive and more content stay tuned thank you very much see you next time